Hi there. We made this video for the partial fulfillment of our requirements on our research subject. Our topic is about cybersecurity. Here are some tips on how to secure your social media account and protect your devices from viruses and malware. Check it out. Tip number one, use a strong password that is easy to remember for your social media accounts. Add numbers to your password. Use different passwords for each of your accounts. If you cannot remember, write it on a notepad app and save it on your mobile device or better yet, use a physical notepad. Tip number two, skip entering the personal info on Facebook and Twitter if you fear that people will stalk your profile. Tip number three, always check your privacy settings on your social media accounts. Tip number four, disable location settings so that people can't see where you are via your social media accounts. In your mobile devices, go to settings, app permissions, location, and simply disable location for the social media application. Tip number five, in Facebook, set your post settings to be visible only to friends of friends so that only the friends of one of your friends can see the post in your timeline. Tip number six, always log out of your social media accounts when using public computers. Tip number seven, use passcodes or passwords to secure your mobile devices and computers because passcodes take a very, very long time to hack. You can also use the more modern fingerprint unlock on Android devices, touch ID for Apple devices, or face unlock, which depends if your device has. You can also use the more modern fingerprint unlock on Android devices, touch ID for Apple devices, or face unlock, which depends if your device has. Tip number eight, be selective with friend requests. Take time to examine their profiles. If you don't know the person, don't accept their requests. Those might be fake accounts. Tip number nine, most people probably just quickly click accept without reading this, but this is important. Read the EULA or the end user's license agreement to familiarize yourself with the privacy policies of the social media channel before accepting.
Tip number 10. Beware of social media copycats. Beware of links like www.fb.com. They are usually fake, but they have a very similar look to the real Facebook website, www.facebook.com. Here are more examples. These usually contain viruses, adware, and also they send personal information inputted by the user, which is unknown to the user who is thinking that this is a legitimate site to the hacker. This can be very dangerous as they might contain personal information such as credit card numbers. These sites also have a hidden source code, which contains the virus file. Once the user clicks on it, it secretly gets downloaded into your device and unpacks itself, manifesting deep inside your system background and collects all sorts of information from you, sometimes even spreading viruses in your device's system. If your account's hypertext transfer protocol secure is activated, chain letters will not work, and the hackers that use them are called fraudsters. Chain letters' purposes are to distribute malwares containing links to malicious websites, and also collect your data once you forward anything to your friends. They can also collect your location info, recent chatmates, or a list of active friends in their social media sites. Tip number 11. Make sure you download trusted antivirus apps like Avira Antivirus, Norton Security, etc. from Google Play Store and Android. Do the same on PC and regularly scan your devices using these applications. Tip number 12. Beware of what you download from the internet. They may have attached hidden files that contain viruses. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed this informational video. Please share this with your family and friends to raise awareness on cybersecurity.